morning, good morning, good morning! So, wala na bakasyon. Tapos na ang bakasyon. Grabe. Kaya, balik tayo sa pagbabasa. Tagal kong natigil sa pagbabasa. Dapat hindi talaga matigil yung pagbabasa kung kahit may bakasyon. Kasi lang, ano na naman ko. Kaya hindi ko din talaga siya nagawa. Dito yung kapatid ko. So, buwi siya. Kaya medyo busy lang. Sa Christmas at saka sa New Year. Yan. Back to ready na tayo. If you are underweight, far fewer people suffer from being underweight than overweight. But if you do, it is no less of a worry. Other women who struggle to keep their weight down probably have little sympathy and may even be envious, but being underweight brings its own problems. Serious loss of weight may be systematic of illness or disease. So it is always important that you get a full checkup at the surgery or hospital. Assuming that there is no underlying illness, check out what and how much you are eating. Eating too little over a sustained period can have the effect of nutritional deficiency from an incomplete diet weakening the immune system, encouraging frequent colds and coughs, low energy and stamina, and general aches and pains, anemia or low blood pressure, causing fatigue, dizziness, nausea, headaches, fainting bouts, breathlessness, fertility problems, increased risk of osteoporosis, if you have a natural fast metabolism not caused by an overactive thyroid or your appetite is gone, you could try the following to maximize your nutrition and increase your energy. Masked banana in cream with a little honey after breakfast. About one tablespoon of cheese steered into a dish of rice or lentils. This form of clarified butter provides a high level of nourish nourishment as it is potentized by thorough churning that breaks down its competent parts, making it easily digested and absorbed. Lean red meat with a lot of salad, lettuce, onions, radishes, tomatoes to aid its digestion. Sufficient fats in healthy forms avocados, nuts, and seeds, nut butters, olive oil, and oil-rich fish. Homemade marabone stock, simmer marabones from organic lamb or beef shank for two hours with garlic, ginger, nutmeg, cinnamon sticks, bay leaves, and whole peppercorns. You can make up a quantity of this strain it and keep it in an individual portion in a freezer drink a mug of stock about an hour before your main meal potatoes pasta and porridge all good source of carbohydrates that aid weight gain kefir kefir This Russian Eastern European preparation, similar to yogurt, is fermented and processed in a particular way. The churning process it undergoes breaks the band between the amino acids, making them easily absorbed and synthesized into protein in the body. Ashwagandha. Ash. Wagandha. 
ashwagandha indian ginseng this is powerful adaptogen example it helps the body adapt to stress and helps to build up energy and muscle bulk. Appetite stimulant. A few suggestions. One teaspoon of brandy in warm water or a small sherry. One teaspoon of jal jerry, a traditional Indian appetite. Jal. Jera. Jaljera. One teaspoon of Jaljera, a traditional Indian appetite enhancer of cumin, tamarind, and black salt in a glass of water. Draksha Sava. Draksha Sava. An Ayurvedic balsam made from grapes and herbs into a weak alcohol drink that stimulates appetite and aids in digestion. Drink one of these half an hour before a meal. Additionally, help your body to relax with a twice weekly massage with a calming aromatherapy oil and the salutation to the sun yoga routine. Cankering hormonal weight gain. Cankering hormonal weight gain. For a significant minority of women, obesity is caused predominantly by a hormonal imbalance. This leads to a buildup of white fat or cellulite. Weight gain linked to the menopause may also open up this hormonally induced variety. Whereas an ordinary weight loss regime works by reducing your reserve of body fat. The aim in correcting hormonal weight gain is to trigger a biochemical change that breaks down cellulite fat and improves hormonal balance. The most effective way to do this is a long fast or of around three weeks, which forces your body to turn to its reserves of white fat for the nourishment it needs to survive. There are currently fewer few places where you can go and safely undertake this fasting therapy, which needs to be done in a clinic under expert supervision. So this is the plan I suggest to patients whom come to me with weight problems that are predominantly hormonal. It is their lasting success that has proved that with determination and patience, this is a program that works. Stage one, a three deep fast. Stage two, follow either the minimal, minimal fat diet or the high protein, low fat, low starch diet for at least six months, preferably low, longer. The first couple of weeks are the hardiest after you begin to enjoy a new way of eating. One day fast once a week. Weekly neck massage to help improve blood flow to the hypothalamus, which controls hormonal output and also fluid retention, which may be adding to your weight. Direct ma massage of the affected area is also beneficial. Yellow fat and white fat. Yellow fat is an ordinary fat that stores our body has created from what we have eaten, but not used up. It can be deposited not only on hips and buttocks, stomachs, limbs, and cheeks, but around the heart and intestines and other organs. White fat is commonly called, commonly called cellulite and most typically appears on the thighs and buttocks as an attractive dimpling effect. It is created when a hormonal imbalance in a woman's body has led to an excess of male hormones. As a protective reaction, the body converts this into oesterosterone, a female hormone resembling 
oestrogen. This spare but safe hormone is then stored in white fat, which can appear not only on the thighs and buttocks, but also the breast, upper arms, and waist. Since cellulite is a repository of exist hormones rather than exist energy, it responds poorly to the sort of diet and exercise regime that reduces yellow fat. Preparation. Prepare yourself mentally for a top regime for at least six months and for a lifelong change to the way you eat. This takes tremendous willpower, so be ready to use whatever works best for you in achieving mind over matter. Be it prayer, meditation or yoga, relaxation techniques. There will be the times when your resolve will weaken, but if, you, but if you give in, the process has to begin again from the beginning because this involves altering your body's biochemistry. You cannot simply compensate for a day's lapse by tiring extra hard the next day. An exercise regime, this may need to be very gentle at first if you are very overweight and out of condition. So take professional advice. Not all excess weight will be white fat. So your yellow fat will begin to reduce with exercise. Stage three, continue to follow the plan outline in the lifestyle program of diet, massage and exercise. As you have a tendency towards hormonally induced fat, you will need to stick to a sensible regime for the rest of your life. The minimal fat diet. For this, you need to cut out all fats and the majority of oils so that your body has to turn its reserves, which includes cellulite, not only to fuel your every activity, but to manufacture the essential fatty acids and cholesterol to keep your basic system functioning. Protein and carbohydrates levels can remain normal, but check that your usual portions are normal and not oversized. Restricting your protein and carbohydrates as well can speed up weight loss, but this is a diet that puts the body under great strain anyway. So do not cut back on these other two food groups as well for longer than three months. Impose too great a burden on yourself, and you are more likely to give up. Boy, uh, foods to avoid. All meat exists. All meat except the lowest fat types. All dairy products except small amounts of low fat yogurt and some low fat milk for cereal and tea. Fats and oils in cooking or for dressing or sauces except very small amount of vegetable or olive oils. Fermented in moderation. Nuts eggs, oil fish, comparatively high in fat, but of a type necessary for health without the skin. This may look at first quite manageable, but as you plan your meals, you will realize just how much we rely on fats in one form or another for cooking and flavoring. You will miss the unplanned and satisfying sense of fullness fat gives. Fat also adds taste, so explore a different ways of making meals as flavorful as possible. In time, a bland diet will re-educate your taste buds, which have probably been dulled by decades of multiple taste sensations in the same meal. They appreciate subtle notions of flavors, but be as inventive as you can within the diet's restriction to help you stay the course. Be wary of reduced fat preparation. The label can just mean lower than usual or indicate the use of fat substitutes that may affect our bodies in ways of which we are unaware. Try to avoid where possible. Meal ideas. Breakfast. Cottage cheese with crushed walnuts or cashew nuts. Ot Meal porridge cooked with half water, half soya or low-fat milk. Fresh fruit, 
boiled or pon poached egg from time to time. Although bread is fermented, it is perhaps not a good choice if you can do without accomplishment like butter and spread. Lunch and dinner. Plenty of vegetables and complex carbohydrates such as rice, potatoes, and pasta. With, with a portion of low-fat meat or fish or vegetable equivalent such as tofu. For protein, in addition to the suggestion above, expand your repertoire with white fish, shellfish, exit crab, high-protein pulses such as black eye beans, lentils, and kidney beans. Low-fat meat. Choose organic chicken and turkey without the skin. Recent study shows fat levels in average chickens are much higher than they used to be. Lean game birds, example, partridge, pheasant breast but not duck or goose. Venison, lamb kidney, veal donut, veal fillet, extra lean ham, ostrich, pork fillet, Rabbit, lean rump steak. Cooking without fat. To, repl to replace the rich smoothness missing from our minimal fat diet. Thick soap based on lentils or dried beans. These are both filling and creamy smooth. Nuts, choose them well so as not to encourage your stomach to increase its acidity and again, eat them only in moderation. Their oil line, the stomach to give satisfactory sensation of fullness. Maximizing flavor. Meals without fat or oil tend to be very bland, but avoid the temptation of adding more salt or sugar in an effort to lift the taste. Most of your cooking will be steaming, baking, and boiling, so experiment with the myride, different herbs and spices available. Only avoiding very hot chilies as these are appetite enhancers, using them in different ways. Marinate meat, fish and vegetables, vegetarian. Marinate meat, fish and vegetarian substitutes such as tofu and soya cubes before cooking. Here are just a few ideas for marinate, marinades. Fresh tomatoes. Onions, garlic, ginger, and mustard, blended or ground to a pulp. Crushed garlic in veal, good with fish. A mix of curry spices and flavorings such as ginger, garlic, cinnamon, cardamom, cloves, and a little turmeric. Finely chopped fresh coriander leaves, crushed garlic in a little, grated lemon zest. Other flavoring enhancing ideas. Make a stuffing with a base of breadcrumbs bound together with a little beaten egg white. Add pepper, a little salt, and whatever flavoring you like. You could include a few finely crushed nuts too. Use it to fill slip cut in poultry or the cavity of the whole fish or as a filling for parcels or rules of thin fillets. Bake in papillotti before cooking in the oven. Silkfish are made in a fuel or greased proof paper parcel with springs. Our fleshy herbs, orange or lemon thyme is very good with fish. Marjoram with chicken. A little sea salt and black pepper. Cooking this way imposes the Flesh with the flavorings and keep it succulent as no juices escape. A variation on this is to use leaves as a warm. Pine, vine, cabbage, or large sorrel leaves. Grill or barbecue meat and fish over a spring of herbs such as rosemary, fennel, thyme, or stalks, or lemongrass. Add finely chopped spring onions and or herbs to mashed potatoes or other pureed root vegetables. A little squeeze of fresh lemon or lime juice is a good flavor vector. The high protein, low starch diet. I must stress straight away that this is not the same as the high protein. 
high fat, low carbohydrate diet popular in recent years. In the regime, I am detail detailing here, the starchy carbohydrates and fats are keep low. The body is forced to rely on its fat reserves, so this is one that can safely be followed over a long period in is an effective way of losing weight that stems from a hormonal imbalance to follow for at least six months, preferably a year. In the main, your energy and nutrition will be coming from 250 to 400 grams of food such as fish, meat, eggs, which are high in protein, with plenty of leafy vegetables and fruits. Foods to avoid. The principal food to cut from your diet are the starchy carbohydrates. Bread, pasta and noodles, rice and other grains including sweet corn, beans, peas and lentils, potatoes and other starchy root vegetables, squashes, pumpkins and their relations, fruits and peas, breakfast cereals. Nuts and seeds vary a lot in their fat and starchy carbohydrates contain. Avoid chestnut, cashews, and peanuts. You should also reduce your fat intake, although not as drastically as the minimal fat diet. In particular, avoid butter, cheese, cream, fatty meats. Meal ideas, breakfast, boiled or poached egg, fresh fruit, Fruit smoothies made with low-fat milk, yogurt, and tea. Lunch and dinner, grilled lean meat with stir few vegetables, casserole poultry or game, nut, duck, or rose, with a selection of vegetables added towards the end of the cooking time or steam or served separately. Fish, grilled or baked, Japanese-style soap with plenty of vegetables and strips of meal, and or fish or tofu punch and flavorful clear broth. Fresh fruit for dessert. Tips when de devising meals. As a guide, the daily protein you should be eating equates to about two milky chicken thighs of two thick sticks of fish. Marinating fish, marinating meat, fish or tofu adds flavor and interest. There are some ideas in the minimal fat diet and you can expand the repertoire with yogurt or olive oil. Saman!
Lunch, dinner. Grilled lean meat with stir fried vegetable. Casserole, poultry, poultry or game, not duck or goose, with a selection of vegetables added towards the end of the cooking time, steamed and served separately. Fish, grilled or baked. Japanese style soap with plenty of vegetables and strips of meat and of fish and of tofu punch and flavorful clear broth. Fresh fruit for dessert. Tips when devising meals. As a guide, the daily protein you should be eating equates to about two meaty of chicken thigh or two sticks, sticks of fish. Marinating meat. Fish or tofu adds flavors and interest. There are some ideas in the minimal fat diet. And you can expand the repertoire with yogurt or olive oil. Fruits such as bananas and fruits such as bananas and mangoes might contribute to weight gain on a normal regime, but are not a protein when you have cut out so much else. So enjoy them and benefit from the nutritional content. Salad vegetable. Eating rows such as lettuce, rocket, celery, watery, water grass, and spring onions help with protein digestion. Riding rice of match to the starch means it is possible to make it part of a meal from time to time. Wash the rice thoroughly. You will see the water is at first cloudy with released starch. Then boil it in plenty of water. Don't steam it. Then transfer to sieve and rinse again thoroughly with a fresh boiling water. Moisha po yan, no? Avoid bread. Bread, pasta, and noodles. Rice. So that's all for today. I'm so glad that I was able to read some. And the next, okay. nababasahin natin bukas. Sana makabasa ulit ako bukas. It's about psychological health. For this time, Bye, God bless, and have a good day. God bless.